Well, dash cam video captured a dangerous exchange between a Carroll County deputy. Take a look right here and a teenager. This all started as a high speed chase, but it ended in gunfire. Fox 5's Joy Duke says at the live desk tonight. Joy, I mean, just dramatic video here. Yeah, absolutely. Eric officials with the Carroll County Sheriff's Office say that deputy is lucky to be alive after a traffic stop that could have turned deadly. Now the 16 year old suspect is potentially looking at up to 88 years in prison. People say routine traffic stop. Nothing's routine. Like it An early morning traffic stop June 22nd took a scary turn for Carroll County Sheriff's Deputy Archie Barber, who says he clocked this 2004 tan Chevy Silverado going 20 miles per hour over the speed limit on Highway 27. Uh, 70 something miles per hour. It's a 55 mile per hour zone. So he goes to pull this suspect vehicle over. Dash camera video shows the driver comply once the deputy turns on his emergency lights, but within seconds of getting out of his car, the suspect takes off. Carroll County Sheriff's Office spokeswoman Ashley Holsey says the high speed chase that followed lasted more than 20 minutes before the driver identified as 16 year old Damian King O'Neill Patterson pulled out a gun and fired shots at the deputy. Oh! Shots fired, shots fired, shots. Sticks his hand out the window, produces a handgun, and fires five rounds, striking the deputy's vehicle. Authorities tell Fox 5 they've learned that firearm and truck were both stolen from the same home in Herb County. We don't really know what motivated him, but we do know when we interviewed him, he was intending to harm uh, the deputy, and that was very evident in the video. Gotcha. Holsey says the deputy did not return fire and was not injured. After Patterson crashed the truck, investigators say he ran and managed to get away that night before deputies caught up with him Friday. She tells Fox 5 it's a cautionary tale for parents to keep a closer eye on what their children are getting into this summer. Make sure that you're keeping those uh, put away so that they don't get in the hands of people like the 16 year old juvenile. And an important reminder for residents not to leave their keys or weapons inside a vehicle. As you saw, just a very scary situation there. Well, Patterson is being charged as an adult. He had his first appearance in court yesterday where a judge read the lengthy list of charges he faces, the most serious criminal attempt to commit murder. From the live desk, Joy Dukes, Fox 5 News. Mm, all right, Joy, thanks.